help wow. you? <laughs> oh. Hmm. What's that squishy sand? It's quicksand. Did you want to know what it is? Let knowledge click. Quicksand looks like regular sand, but it's not. Ooh. It's a mix of sand, water, oh, and clay. Oh. It feels soft and wobbly. Quicksand is often found near rivers, beaches, swamps, wet forests. That's where water stays under the sand. But if it's just sand and water, how can it make people sink? When you step on quicksand, the sand and water slide apart. Your foot gets stuck in heavy, sticky mud underneath. If you wiggle a lot, it gets tighter and pulls you down. But you still helped my dad get out. Of course. <laughs> People are lighter than quicksand, so they don't sink all the way in. So if you ever fall into quicksand, just do the steps I show your dad. Don't scream or move a lot. Take a deep breath and keep your body still. Lean back like you're floating on water. Let's spread your weight and the sand won't hold you tight. Lift one leg slowly. Don't pull hard. Then push gently with your hands to move back to solid ground. That's it for today. Join Wufu as he continues exploring the amazing world in the next episode. <laughs> It's dangerous out there! The tornado is coming, Wufu! Uh, a tornado? Hmm. Let's talk about tornadoes, shall we? Let's knowledge! Click! Tornadoes usually begin with a thunderstorm or a storm. Warm air goes up into the clouds, and cooler air comes down. This makes the air spin around, forming rotating air currents. If the spinning air gets strong enough, its pointy part can touch the ground and turn into a tornado. But I still want my ball back. Mm, tornadoes are way more dangerous than you think. As the tornado moves, it can destroy everything in its parts and cause severe damage. Most tornadoes only last about 10 minutes. During that time, make sure to find a way to keep yourself safe. When a tornado occurs, quickly seek shelter in an underground bunker or a sturdy building to ensure safety. If you cannot get to a shelter, hide under a table and stay away from windows. Got it! Where does the wind come from? Oh, I'll explain to you. Let knowledge click. Wind oh. starts with the sun, Wufu. Really? The sunlight hits the air on Earth, but not evenly. When the sun shines, the warmer air rises up into the sky. Then cooler air from the other places rushes in to fill the empty space. And just like that, the wind begins to blow. But the wind just blew away our cake and picnic <laughs> mat. It didn't help at all. Oh no, Wufu. Wind can help people in many ways. Look! The wind helped sailboat travel across the ocean. Wow. 
the wind can make electricity for the whole village. And the wind lets us play super fun games too. Wind is helpful, but strong wind can also be dangerous. So tell me, kids, what should you do to stay safe on a very windy day? Run and play when it's windy. Stay under big strong trees. Keep away from things that might blow away. What's that colorful robe? It's a rainbow. Oh. Hmm. Did you know what it is? Let knowledge click! White sunlight splits into many colors when it passes through water. That's called dispersion. What colors can you see? Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. Oh no! The rainbow is fading! Rainbows won't stay for long. Mm. Rainbows only appear when sunlight and tiny water drops are both in the sky. When the sun goes away or the drops dry up, the rainbow disappears too. Uh. Do you want to make a rainbow? Uh. <laughs> Ooh. Wow! A real rainbow! Why is this one a circle? Rainbows are actually full circle. But because you see them from the ground, you can only see a half of it. I want to have one more. You're making double rainbow. Wow. A double rainbow happens when sunlight bounces twice inside a raindrop. It makes two rainbows. The second one is lighter and the colors go the other way around. Can a rainbow ever be upside down like this? Yes! Sometimes you might see an upside down rainbow. It happens when sunlight bends through tiny ice crystal high up in the sky. It makes a rainbow that curves up, like a big smile in the sky. We got it! That's it for today. Join Wufu as he continues exploring the amazing world in the next episodes. Discover everything around us on Wolfu Explore Channel.